fellow Lake Mar backers and Lake Mar fans, here we are at Origins 2019, and we have a little special guest for special prize for those of you who are not here. Please forgive me; it is Sunday at the con, so all right. So it's Sunday at the con, so uh, please bear with us. But we have for you a official unboxing of the Lake Mar box set and accoutrements, which is, with any luck, be winging your way sometime soon. Don't hold me to that. Okay, here we go. If you look this down, the first thing you will see when it finally turns up is this wonderful carton. This is our shipping container. As you can see, it has wonderful artwork on it, and it is only slightly banged up. So this is probably exactly what it looks like by the time it comes to your house. This is a survived trip from New York here to Columbus, so with any luck, uh, it will survive to your house as well. So once you get it home, we're going to open this up, and look at that. Look at that. That is the amazing Dungeon Call Classics Lankmar box set. Artwork by the Coex. And inside, it has everything you need to begin your journey in DCC Lankmar. As you can see, it contains the Compendium of Secret Knowledge, which is all the optional rules uh, for how to adapt DCC RPG to DCC Lankmar. I would stress that it is optional. You can be played straight with the blue book that we're all familiar with, or with various little things to tweak it to your own home style like bar. After you peruse that, it is time to look at the Judges Guild to new one. And inside, this is all the stuff for the judges' eyes only. You will see, we talk about backgrounds, about the lands of Daewon, about the religion, the cultures, the peoples of Lankbar. We talk about the Lankbar calendar, the Daewon calendar, uh, the days of the week. We also cover various new spells. We have patron information. We have a new new thing called uh, patron dice, for those of you who are unfamiliar with it. We have the, uh, the various patron charts. We have magical items, and we have monsters. More than enough to keep your going for a long, long time in Newon. After you finish that, it is time to set your city sights on the city of Lankmar, the city of the Black Toga. And this is your guide to Lankmar itself. We have, uh, we have the description of the city. We have geomorphs, which can be used to plug in ideas. We have various talks about the life in the city, about dealing with the authorities, about how to lay low. We have various rules to determine quick what the building does, how many stories it is, stories it is. Uh, people, why are random people on the streets? We have NPCs to be met. We have adventure seeds. We have an entire section on how to quickly design your own little neighborhood. Interesting NPCs to encounter and much, much more. Having now condemned that is down to chart your first adventure, which is no small crimes in Lankmar. This has been a very popular one at conventions. Uh, we've run it several times, myself and others, uh, and um, unfortunately the cover gives a little away. Uh, yeah, at one point you may find a giant cat. All right, or maybe, maybe not. <laughs> I won't spoil anymore. It also includes this fantastic judges screen. It's a three panel judges screen. So it works perfectly in your, with your existing DCC judges screen all that information right at the tip, tips of your fingers. And now we're going to get more and more to the, the Those of you who are probably have already familiar with Doug Kovacs' map of Lightbar. This is the paper version of it, not the, uh, the cloth version that some of you are maybe have already upgraded to. But as you can see, it is a beautiful work of art. And it is, uh, it's probably at least it looks about three feet long and maybe about 18 inches long, 18 inches wide, so got a lot, a lot of space to adventure on. We have a black and white map of Newon. It can be laminated upon and then drawn with your wet dry eraser uh, to chronicle your trips through the entire campaign world. As you go from level one to the heights of, of Lake Bar Tech, we have, uh, those are the Goodman Games Gazette. Now some of you are already familiar with the Goodman Games Gazette. This is more than just a Goodman Game Gazette. It is also our Lankmar version, which uh, includes a handy dandy uh, guide to creating citizens and scoundrels in the city of Lankmar. Very quick uh, NPC generator if you need little traits about them. We have various discussions about uh, information that we've brought up 
uh, more interesting stuff uh, to uh, flesh out your NPCs. We have a couple of articles. We have the rules for Rat Snake, if you have missed it. And uh, various articles uh, by yours truly and others, including the always popular Archmage Anime. All right. And then what is left is there, of course. So once you have it, you want to go home and start up a Dungeon Crawl Classics Road Crew game at your local from the game store. So here is your here is your included poster to go do and make that a uh, make that a reality. But wait, there's much much more. If you've got it for the whole bundle, we have waiting for you. Eat more supplements, adventures, and other such, including Gang Lords of Lagmar. This is your first level adventure to get things going after you complete No Small Crimes. You can then move on to The Fences for Two Witches Folly, which will take you into the voice of level two. Just when you get done then, it's time to go to the theater for a little bit of acting up in Lankmar. After that, it's off to the temple to deal with violence for Votishal. Then there's more blasphemy and larceny in Lankmar. Skullduggery. A foot. And then if you've made it that far, it's time to see if you can cheat death. This is our level one adventure, but it actually scales from one to five and possibly even more. And to round things off, we have a dozen Lankmar locations. I'm very happy with this one. It helps flesh out what's already in the Lankmar City Guide by giving you 12 locations, which includes uh, descriptions of what is what is to be found in there, along with maps of each location. For example, that is the famous Thieves House, Homes of the Thieves Guild. You don't want to go in there, but in case you end up in there, your judge will know how to make your life interesting. Uh, and obviously, as you can imagine, there are 12 locations over the course of this. Lastly, there is uh, when it's time to move out of Lagmar because the heat has gotten too high. It is time to go ahead north to the land of eight cities. This is a uh, com well, it's a source book that describes the land of eight cities. Yeah. This completes information co contains information that I dug up at the University of Houston Library when I was examining the Fritz Library collection in there. So uh, this is a lot of the information here is based on an unpublished manuscript. Uh, it details the land of the eight cities. We have new gods, we have new patrons. We have uh, we have uh, new uh, carousing. Uh, if we get done carousing in Lankmar, time to go carousing to the land of the eight cities, where entirely new adventures and misfortunes await you. Uh, we have an introductory adventure for taking you into the land of the eight cities. And uh, for those of you who were unfortunately not able to make it to Houston, we have this full-colored section describing my trip to the Fritz Library paper collection, uh, including art, including pictures of some of the artifacts that I found there. In. So, uh, I am very, very happy to finally have this in my hands. It's been a long five years since we first announced this, uh, and it is, it's good to see that those five years were not, well, uh, not poorly spent. Uh, and I believe that once you finally get this in your hands, you will be in complete agreement. So, uh, keep watching the mailboxes so uh, with any luck uh, it's as I'm speaking now it is somewhere in the middle of the Pacific on its way here uh, we hope to get here as soon as humanly possible uh, I would give you a rough estimate because but I'm off I, I, if I'm off Joe will kill me so I would just play it safe and say coming soon on its way get ready DCC like mine